are thinking of you all month long, and we want you to feel special shopping with us. Well, it is Customer Appreciation Month, and we appreciate you, not just today, not just this month, but every day of the year. We wouldn't be here without you. I'm your host, Robin Wall. Mike Mizak is joining us with Coin Collector. Uh -huh. And boy, we have a jam-packed show this coins. morning. <laughs> really, Mike? We have coins. We have coins. We do. It's coin collector. I went up an octave. Um, and you know what? We have some brand new pieces we're going to be sharing we with do. everybody. We have a showstopper. And I was really excited. And I know Mike in particular was talking about the Explore and Discover set. That's, Very cool. That's some, brand a, a new. U.S. Mint first. Okay. Oh, it is? Mm -hmm. nice. When we get to that. It's the first time the government has ever issued a blank planchet. Huh? Oh. Okay. We'll okay. get to that. I'll show it to you. It's very cool. And it comes with some unique packaging uh -huh. as well. Packaging. That's right. Yeah. And so stay certified, tuned. very limited edition. We'll get to that. Though. All right. So stay tuned. That's coming up. We have other brand new items we'll be sharing with you. I'm excited. The peace dollars are back. We haven't had those in quite some time. Yep. So those are finally back in stock. I think after like eight months, we have three right. different years there. But we're going to jump into the Barbie coin. Yeah. Now, first and foremost, when we think about coin collecting, we would not think there would be a coin for Barbie. But there is. It is one of the hottest selling toys of all time. Such an iconic figure, Barbie. This is celebrating the 60th anniversary. It's a colorized silver coin. It's $129.95. It is on three flexible payments this morning of $43.32. But Mike, when we talk about limited editions, this yeah. is minimal. This is small. They only made 5,000 of these for worldwide distribution. Okay. We have a very, very tiny quantity of that because we've been, you know, longtime distributors of, of a lot of these specialized coins. Uh, uh, you know, we do Disney and we do big bounce and we do all those but Barbie is kind of a, a really special particularly given the 60th anniversary that they've done of that where they've done this incredible case that comes with that that's the iconic Barbie motif that you're gonna retro. have that's very retro I like her little ponytail and that's right and then of course you know this this lights up when you open it up and Mike, it's like this a is compact as close as I get to bathing suit season yeah that's right <laughs> <laughs> Mike's like TMI I don't want to yeah, hear about right, that right. but look how cute she is in her black and white bathing suit that's right now that that's important because the very first Barbie that was ever made and issued wore that bathing suit. That was the, this yeah. is what it was, Barbie number one is this right here. That was here. literally her outfit. That was literally her outfit right wow. there uh, uh, 60 years ago uh, when it was finally released. And like I said, so it's done in solid silver. You got the, the specialized packaging that you're going to have here with the compact uh, uh, with that that lights up. So, I mean, you know, it is incredible. And then from a coin standpoint, only 5,000 coins issued. So if you had a U.S. silver dollar with only 5,000 coins issued, you could add one or even two zeros to that price of $129.95. We have a very limited quantity remaining out of our original allocation. Like I said, only $129.95. One ounce pure silver comes with the specialized packaging, incredibly limited edition with the collector box, once again in that black and white Barbie. motif uh, uh, as well. And you can see, I mean, honestly, the coin is really spectacular, but mm -hmm. the packaging is uh, over the top. Mm -hmm. I mean, you know with Barbie, I mean, look at the black and white. You can see the compact right in there. Kind of retro, very vintage, kind of that 1950s glamour. The black and the white, it's just really stunning. And then we'll look down here. That is your coin. I love the way it lights up. Look how it's surrounded by those pink crystals. Mm -hmm. For any daughter in your life, for anyone who loves Barbie, this is that heirloom collectible. And this is really nice because maybe it's your daughter and you love to sit down and play Barbies. This is one of those coins that you can give her, you can put in her hope chest, and it's precious metal, right, Mike? Yeah, now it's pure silver in there as well, incredibly limited edition from a numismatic standpoint. I, I, great, great, great collectibles, what we have in final quantity. That's right. We only have two, a little over 200 available. 655-423 is your item number. But we are celebrating you all month long. And I always love when Mike brings in brand new pieces to share with us. This is the 2019 Explore and Discover set. Mike, give us the, a quick lowdown. This is just a little sneak peek. This is still well, the comments uh, on Showstopper. If you remember the rocket ship set that, that do, we that did. that was on like it's wildfire. On Fire. Right. It's ridiculous. So I, I, we still have a few of those. We'll do some of those. So they did another set called Explore and Discover that they did 50,000 only in the limited edition. But in this one, there's a special 
edition penny. I guess this is the year of the penny from the United it States is, Mint right? with the W Mint penny. But more importantly, look at that blank planchet. The United States government has never intentionally released a blank planchet in its past. Anything that has ever come out with a blank uh, a blank planchet like that has always been an error, has tremendous, Didn't tremendous value. Stamp set? We did, but those were all error coins oh. that just got out. They actually released this as, as a part of the set, this blank planchet, to make it look so you knew what a penny looked like before it was struck. But then the penny is also specialized as well. We've got our first day of issue that we're going to have with this, only 1,304. I believe that'll be 100% sellout uh, today. Nice. Well, I think was, we'll sell all 1,300 today. So 669, I missed the last three digits. 5A1. Boy, Rick's on fire with those digits for me this morning. <laughs> He's like, it's Rob and I have to pay attention. Um, all right, we're moving along and we're going to move into the American Innovation Dollar. Now, this is on auto ship. Mike's going to tell you the whole backstory behind this coin, mm -hmm. but really, this is a perfect way to celebrate those innovators from all 50 states plus the six territories, right? Yeah. Isn't mm -hmm. the territories doing yeah, this one? Mm -hmm. Okay, absolutely. Perfect. And, and it's on two flex this morning, 44.98. So they're doing the special golden dollar program of the American Innovation Series. They did a special introductory coin in 2018, which is what this is, with the special motif on it. And we can finally see what the reverse of the coin uh, uh, looks like that we're going to have right there. They're going to be releasing four coins per year. Now, this is in our exclusive premiere edition from PCGS. So you can see it's Premier, that's a special, that's an exclusive uh, uh, brand to me. I'm the only one that can sell PCGS Premier that you have. Uh, it's going to be an auto ship. Here's the box that it's going to come in, but here's the incredible part of this. I, I, I was just talking, I have a quantity of these available, so we're bringing this out for the very first time. This is in PCGS, PR70 Deep Cameo. I sent in a thousand original sets from the United States Mint. Remember, the 2018 Mint set, or proof set, did not include this dollar. It only came out in its own individual dollar uh, set that you're going to have. I sent in a 1,000 of these, and we have like 150. I was gonna, it I just don't even think we have 150. doesn't, I'm sorry, 132. 132. And that's all that I have out of 1,000 coins that we sent in. It is virtually impossible uh, uh, that you can see it to get all of this and to be able to get this big open field in PR70. And at $89.95, like I said, I challenge you in PCGS, let alone in my exclusive label and the premier label right here, to get this at $89.95. More importantly, it is going to also give you the opportunity with AutoShip to get all of the next coins in PR70 absolutely perfect at only $89.95. Now here's the thing. So they're actually starting the collection this year. They're going to be in 2019. They're not going to be in the regular proof sets. So they're only going to come in their own specialized sets. They're going to be exceptionally expensive, comparatively speaking, in year, from years past. You are locking your price in. You're locking PCGS. You're locking Perfection in and the Premier Series right here. So we literally had to grade a 1,000 coins to get, what, 13 dozen. Right. To get 13 dozen it's coins, lot. it's not. It's one of the lowest for modern issue proof coins. It is one of the lowest grading percentages that I've seen uh, that I've seen out there. And so it's PCGS. Now let's look at the label, the premier label. This is 100% exclusive to me. And so well, this is a separate line item on the PCGS uh, report. In other words, what they call their population report that tells you how many of these coins are, are, are in existence. And I can tell you right now. Now, you know how many in our existence? 132, okay, <laughs> is exactly what it was. We sent those in, and normally a brand new, a brand new, oh my goodness, they're going quickly. And here's what's gonna happen. You know, I, I, already these coins are extremely difficult to get. They're not in the proof sets. They're gonna be one of the rarest dollars ever made by the United States government, because they're only made for two weeks in 2018. So it's not just getting this coin <laughs> in PCGS, but then also getting it in the premier holder that is 100 
100% exclusive to me as well. To be able to get the auto ship, and then of course we're gonna have the great box that's gonna come with this. So the auto ship is going to come and you're gonna get four coins per year, and as you can see I right guess here. as released by the government. As released by the government. Okay. And so uh, uh, they're not gonna be in the proof sets this year. So they're going to come out individually as well. And as they're released, you'll be able to get yours. But here's the Will key. Will they be proof? They're all gonna oh, be proof. They're, they're all gonna be 70, just like this, for $89.95. So that, every single coin is going to be proof. Yes, and Seven. Premier Label, wow. our exclusive Premier Label, there's literally 13 dozen people, uh, a baker's dozen dozen, uh, is ultimately what it comes down to that can get this coin right now. Now let's say I send another 1,000 coins, what if I only get 80 or 90 or 100? You have to understand, that's literally thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars. <laughs> literally, <laughs> to be able to do that. So in terms of the American Innovation Dollar, this is the proof version. It's certified perfect, it's certified deep cameo. It's got the exclusive Premier PCGS label that you're going to have on that as well. This is going to be, in the Innovation Dollars, this will be the rarest of NGC, of, of, uh, uh, of Annex, of PCGS. The PCGS is by far the rarest and the Premier is the rarest of the PCGS. This is your opportunity to get in on this right now. Once we're subscribed to this, I do not know how many more people that we're gonna be able to put into that program. Already, the government has, has stopped making, they only made for two weeks this coin last year. It's the first inaugural coin like this. So they're not gonna to continue to make this No, coin. they can't. They only made them in 2000, and like I said, they only made them in 2018 for two weeks. It wasn't in the and proof that's set. It. That's it. It wasn't in the proof set from 2018. You, you have to understand that. Right. So it was a standard standalone proof coin. The only thing that even comes close to that is the 19, uh, what is it, the 1999 Susan B. Anthony. The 1999 Susan B. Anthony coin, in this condition, absolutely, I mean, it can be 299, 399, 499 in PCGS. The coin just simply doesn't exist. And this coin, is going to be probably five times rare, somewhere right, right around in there, and three, four, five times. you can secure time. auto ship. Right. You can secure all 56. And your price guaranteed can never go up. to get the 70. Mm -hmm. So imagine how many you'd have to buy on your own to make mm -hmm. sure you'd get the 70 if you're trying to collect all 56. Mm -hmm. So you're getting that inaugural coin, mm -hmm. and then you're signing up for auto ship. You're always in control. If you get a coin and you're like, eh, I want to stop auto ship. There's right. no fee to stop. It's really our obligation to make sure you're getting the best of the best at $89.95. We're, I think, Rick, are we below 100 now on this auto ship? We're about to gonna go uh, below that 100. And that is it. Are you gonna add to this auto ship or is this like. I mean, you know, as soon as I get another 2,000 coins, you know, right. it's like 200. Right. But the fact of the matter is, is I can't do it in prime time. Right. I mean, we have uh, we had 100 and almost 150 coins. Uh, uh, we're about to go under 100 coins. Understand the rarity of this. The fact that not only is this dollar going to be rare just in general, but to get it in 70. The fact that it's extraordinarily difficult to get in this. Will you explain that again and why it's sure. hard to get it in the 70? A absolutely. Well, all, all I have to do is flip it over. <laughs> look at this. Look at the field on right. this coin. Anything in there and it's not a 70. So now you understand why it's grading like 10, 12% is all that it is. And these are brand new coins in original government packaging that you're going to have that are grading 10% or even less that you're going to have in there because of this. And so because of that and, and the difficulty of getting this coin in its, in its incredibly high grade at PCGS, it's why this is premier, it's why it's exclusive, it's why it's the rarest of the PCGS labels, the, uh, certainly that we sell in any way, shape, or form. Because of that, getting this in 70, and then having the opportunity to get all the other coins in 70, when you've seen uh, a PCGS a PR70 innovation dollars sell for significantly more than $89.95. So we have a fantastic price on this. We have the, uh, the opportunity to lock in your price going forward, to lock in perfection going forward for as long as you choose to stay in the program. Remember, the obligation is ours and the opportunity is yours. We, your price can never go up and your delivery is guaranteed for the entirety of the program. So you're going to get mm -hmm. the brand new American Innovation Dollar, which I think is one of the most spectacular coins ever put out by the United States government. It's going to be every single state in the union is going to honor their uh, uh, American innovator or an invention so or an entrepreneur. It's going to be different for every state. Four per year, four per year until okay. every single state and territory is accounted nice. for. Nice. And this is final quantities that mm -hmm. are available 
available that mm -hmm. we have for this auto ship at this moment in time. Mm -hmm. Two flexible payments of $44.98. Remember, you always have a 30-day money-back guarantee. Secure your order for auto ship. You can cancel at any time. Also, very mm -hmm. rarely do we get extra flex with our HSN credit card. Oh my goodness. It, I know. So it's Customer Appreciation Month, and I can't even believe they extended it to coins. Typically, they don't do that. So Customer Appreciation Month, if you're shopping with your HSN credit card, you can get an extra flex on that set. Now, also, still to come is our 2019 U.S. Mint Proof Set, and this is for the first time that it's coming with that Lincoln Penny from the West Point Mint, mm -hmm. and this has already been wildly popular since you launched it here at HSN. Yeah, it's it's been ridiculously popular. It continues to be very difficult coin to get in this. The very first time that the West Point Mint has ever made and released a United States Penny. When we get to it and I show it to you, you'll understand why getting this in any grade, but particularly in Proof 69, is extraordinarily difficult. We had a few Proof 70s, I think, for $249 or somewhere around there. I don't know if I have maybe a dozen or so of those remaining. They're virtually impossible to get in uh, Proof 70 and 69. They're exceptionally hard to get, and you'll see why that is the very first West Point minted Lincoln set. Plus, you get the entire proof set from 2019 with that as well in the original government package. So stay tuned. That's still to come. And it is Customer Appreciation Month. Typically, it is $10 off when you apply for the HSN credit card and upon approval. But it's Customer Appreciation Month, so we're going to double that and take it to $20 off your very first purchase. And maybe, perhaps, it's going to be this cute, adorable panda <laughs> with its mama. And look at the baby panda and then the mama or papa, I guess, whichever one. I don't know. Yeah, I think that one's a mama. So, yeah, okay. Yeah, you, you have to understand that the so Chinese cute. panda has been around longer than the American eagle, actually. The, really? the Chinese panda started in 1982, as a matter of fact, and has been going continuously since then. Uh, uh, the United States eagle, uh, silver eagle, of course, the most popularly collected mm -hmm. silver coin in the world. But the panda is probably the second most popularly collected silver coin in the world, and it's, it's very long-lived, as a matter of fact, because of that. One of the cool things about the panda is they change the obverse every year. So this design is unique to 2019. Now, unlike the American Silver Eagle, we, you know, we had our American Silver Eagle uh, first day of issue here that we did at HSN for our Today Special. We sold about 12,000 coins. I don't get that many pandas. Now, we that have a lot of those. 11 of these. That's it. Out of the 389 in the entire limited edition. And the reasoning behind that is, of course, that, you know, this is very popular in Asia. It's difficult to get the coins. It's difficult to get them here, uh, uh, to be able to uh, to even get them and degrade them. And then given the, the very high value of the coin in terms of, uh, uh, you know, all the open fields and all these other it's things, very they're very difficult to get in Mint State 70, which is why the limited edition for the entire thing is only 389. I've got about 10 dozen remaining in that limited edition is what we're going to have. And like you said, what a great, uh, uh, what a great uh, uh, view that is. This particular motif and design with the uh, mother panda and the baby panda it's so that cute. you're going to have right there in in pure silver as well, 30 grams pure silver there. And you know what? This is always one that I'm kind of partial to. One time, I think I w when I was working with Mike, I asked Mike, I was like, "How do I know what to collect? What should I collect?" And he always said, "Collect what you like. Collect what kind of speaks to you." And this has always been a coin year after year that I'm always taken by. I think it's just how adorable the panda is. And if you're someone who loves to go to the zoo, you love the pandas or it's just something that speaks to you, get it home. Check it out. It's always, you know, coin collecting, once you get one and you start learning the story, you start learning the history, and you start understanding the collectability, the rarity of the coins, you kind of, you get hooked. And that's kind of what happened to myself working <laughs> alongside Mike. So come on in. Maybe this is your first purchase here at HSN. It's Customer Appreciation Month. We're doing all kinds of fun things and sweepstakes and awards and things. So check it out. Get your order in, 6530 six two but Mike if someone's not familiar with the panda coin as you mentioned I like that they change it every year because it I, makes I, it fun to collect. I, like I kind of wish they did that on the American the Eagle, Eagle and they really haven't right. done that uh, I think it's a really cool way to do it so that when you look at your collection instead of just the dates being different every you know every coin is is different remember there is a red oak presentation box that does come with this of course uh, uh, that you're going to have that's another $14 and, and 95 cent value that you're going to have with that we're only $109.95 for this with the, like I said, first day of issue. There's only 389 in the limited edition. Mm -hmm. There's a, only about 100 of these remaining out of that limited edition. And then once we do the, the 
that's in our first day of issue. And then once that's sold out, of course, we can never do first day uh, of issue again. And so we wait then for the two, for the 2020 coin, uh, uh, which is going to be you know, actually you know almost a year away now. Mm -hmm. So because of that and the very limited edition, you know, we we just don't have enough to go around. I think we've aired it only one or two other times yeah, that we've done left. this. That's why there's so few of these remaining with only, like I said, only about 100 coins remaining. But you've got the great motif here, like I said, and it changes every year. And that's one of the things, as you said, so each year then is unique, mm -hmm. not only by date, but by uh, uh, but by design as well. Now, the uh, reverse of the coin is the same on all of them since 1982. And you take a look at some of those early pandas, the 82 stuff, I mean, they can bring literally thousands of dollars, just like some of the early wow. American Silver Eagles uh, as well. So you put all that together, it becomes abundantly collectible, and then add in the limited edition, add in it's the second most collected silver coin in the world today that you're going to have, the fact that it is very difficult for you to get that here in the United States because the vast majority of these coins stay in, uh, uh, stay in Asia, and so it's difficult to get them here. Uh, importing them becomes even increasingly difficult uh, with that only 389 in the limited edition. Like I said, I think we're down to about 100 coins. That's right. And Mike, is that the Temple of Heaven on the back? It is the Temple of Heaven on the back. And then you, you so said you read, this always so you read the same. Chinese? Huh? Yes. <laughs> yes, 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 I do. I cheated. Why do you have to call me out? See, we have these little cards. <laughs> I don't. So as I was going, I was quite impressed. So I don't, oh, darn I don't read a word. I <laughs> You know me better than that. <laughs> um, but here's the thing. With everybody calling in, this is extremely limited. We are offering it on flexible payments, extra flex with your HSN credit card. And one of the things, if you're new to Coin Collector here at HSN, is we offer a 30-day money-back guarantee. Typically, if you were to go into any coin store, you go out into the world of coin collecting, there is not really a return policy. So we really want you to be 100% thrilled with your purchase. Mike wants you to be 100% thrilled. He is our resident numismatist. He is our expert, a leading expert out in the world of coins. And really, he brings us the best of the best. You cherry pick the finest coins and bring us the most rarest, most collectible coins. And year after year, this is always a coin we come back to. Yeah, I've been selling this every year I've been here at, right. at HSN. I have so, I mean, I think this would be this is the 17th, uh, 17th uh, different silver panda that I've yeah. sold here. Uh, uh, like I said, in first day of issue and in annex that we have like this, that is exclusive. By the way, this is exclusive to us here at HSN. So that's an important component as well. So when you get that, when you get the exclusivity of the of the label and first day of issue uh, that you have there, what you do have is a guaranteed low price. So in other words, you can't buy that. You know you can't buy this for less than $109.95. So that is, uh, you know, that's kind of comforting as a consumer to know, look, hey, I'm getting the best possible price on this. So anything you see out there, let's say in the marketplace, was of course purchased here first. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So six five three zero six two three flexible payments extra flex with your hsn credit card twenty seven dollars and forty nine cents to get this at home interest free on those four monthly installments and that is with your hsn credit card any major credit card with three flexible payments so check that out even paypal but i have been talking a lot about customer appreciation month and of course we appreciate you and are you ready for a chance to win big well with so many places to sh places to shop we want you to know your loyalty doesn't go unnoticed so as part of our customer appreciation month celebration we're giving one lucky winter or winner twenty five thousand dollars wow so every or enter every day through april 30th and just search sweepstakes at hsn.com rick do you think we can enter no <laughs> no, but you can, and that's most important. So we thank you for shopping here at HSN. We know there's a lot of places to shop, and honestly, we wouldn't be here without you. And over 40 years now in the industry, and we truly have the best customers here at HSN. So I personally thank you, and thank you for always shopping with me as well, and Mike, for Coin Collector. But as we continue to move right along, we are going, what are we moving into next? Oh, this is the Lincoln Penny. Now, Mike, this kind of created quite a buzz, like on the internet. Like everybody was so excited, coin collectors, the fact that, you know, typically 10 coins, now you're getting that extra with the Lincoln cent. Right. And the United States government decided to do something kind of cool. So they're uh, issuing the regular approved set that you see right here, which is a very cool thing to do. Uh, uh, good on them. Uh, they made, for the very first time, 
time, they made the first W or West Point minted Lincoln scent. They did it in proof, as you can see right here. Now, normally we try to do as best we can, we do proof 70. Uh, and you can maybe go on hsn.com, we might have the proof 70 up there. I only had a couple of them, because I only graded 4,000 of these, I think. So I, Mike says he graded them. He technically No, I personally didn't. We <laughs> sent them in for certification. Let's well, just clarify, because yeah. everybody's going to think Mike's sitting at home grading coins. <laughs> well, I kind of do, but yes, I didn't grade these. Right. The specific coins uh, is what we did. So we sent in literally thousands and thousands and thousands of sets. We got a couple of hundred seventies mm -hmm. out of thousands and thousands and thousands. And then uh, I got some PR69s and all the rest of them, PR68, 67, 66, 65, I mean, grades we haven't seen uh, uh, from, from sets in 20 or 25 years. Oh, yeah, yeah, let's take a look at that if we can. He said he had, we had the 70. $249.95 for the 70. I have a very, very few of those yeah. if you want the 70. So that's available on hsn.com. Oh, I was trying to right. see the item number for everybody. Yeah, yeah. 667. 562 is your item number on and we have just a hand seven. and we just have a handful okay. of those so but this is going to be the most affordable grade in essence that we're going to have is a pr69 now people are going well why aren't they 70 i mean you know if i graded them out of these sets i mean we get a lot of pr70s if we do you know uh, the kennedys or we did the uh, uh the second if we go down here when the government issued these proof sets they did this really fantastic West Point Minute Penny. And then they send it to you. In a plastic bag. After how many times like have a, we I guess that's here? a tiny sandwich bag. <laughs> it's a tiny Remember, sandwich I, I warn you about getting stuff in tiny sandwich bags. You do. Well, the men sent this. And, uh, okay, that's like a 67. Okay, right. and now that's a 65. Right. And, and so all you have to do, and I remember you and I sold this set uh, last time we were on the air, and you said you bought one of these from the U.S. Mint, and, and, it, and, and as soon as you opened up the mint, the proof set, what happened? It fell out of the box. Fell out of the box right onto the floor. Honestly, I didn't even, it was like I opened the packaging and it like hit the table right and you're right then instantly you're damaging the coin that's right and so now you've got it even has a little u.s mint packaging on it so we had these coins certified so that you know that you get a decent coin pr69 in this is the, is the highest what we would call retail grade in other words the one that's uh, the most affordable like i said we had a few 70s but they're 249 dollars because they're so conditionally rare so you're going to get the pr69 now it comes to you like this it comes in the red oak presentation box so the box itself that you're looking at right here is fourteen dollars and ninety five cents and you plus, get that you get that plus you get the other you get the full proof set as well so I mean the proof set with uh, uh, you know shipping and handling is almost forty bucks I think is ultimately what it comes down to a little less than forty dollars so you have fifty five or sixty dollars between the set and the box so you're really in this for about forty bucks well and, then, what about uh, the and then the certifications thirty dollars so by the time you look at it what you're doing is is for the same price as you could get it if, you know, however you did it with the cost of certification, you're getting a guaranteed high grade uh, uh, set with the very first West Point minted Lincoln set ever to be done by the United States government. You get the entire set with that as well. Uh, I, I think it's a critically important coin. It is a coin that's going to be collectible literally for generations to come, and you're going to get the original proof set as well. Look, the United States government has been making coins at the West Point Mint for quite some time now. They've just never made a penny that they put a mint mark on. I think it was in 82, what was it, 82, oh, so 83, 84. I think they made a bunch of pennies to help out. They needed more coins. You mean at the West Point? At Mint, the West Point huh? Mint, but they were regular P's and D's, but they didn't put a mint mark on them. So they're indistinguishable. We have no idea which ones are there. So the West Point Mint has made pennies, but they've never signed them, so to speak. And so they did this for the very first time. And so you have this Lincoln set. And so the Lincoln set, you have P's and you have D's and you have S's and you have all these things, one of the most popularly collected coins on the planet today but the very first time that it's sporting a little West Point mint mark that you're going to have on there. I have it certified, as you can see right here, PR69 Deep Cameo, comes with the presentation box, and I, ha and, and I just want to show you, this is why it's so important that you get the coin certified, because this right here is just... 
I mean, it's just, it's kind of a shame, I have to be honest with you. Does that drive it, you bonkers? It does. <laughs> because I know that this is such an important coin. And then if we could have got these right. more of those coins and saved, so I guess it makes the coins that are in 70 and even 69 so much more valuable, so much more collectible when you have the fact that the vast majority is, and understand, the, uh, the ones that are out there and floating around, what if they're not graded yet? You know, all you have to do is move the set, you know, move the box, and it, it, mm -hmm. you know, it goes back and forth in the box, and all of a sudden there's scratches, because there's really nothing protecting that Lincoln scent. I don't think they that thought about that. Yeah, I don't think they did. They looked at it as an extra and they treated it as an extra when really it's the star of the show is ultimately what it comes down to. So uh, uh, that's critically important. You are going to get the entire United States proof set with it as well. So you get all there's the, all the uh, uh, National Parks quarters that you're going to have for this year. So you get the five quarters, you get the penny, uh, uh, the penny, the nickel, the dime, uh, the half dollar, and of course the uh, Sacagawea gold dollar. And that's the special Sacagawea Golden Dollar honoring the 50th anniversary uh, of uh, Apollo 11. Well, uh, with since that's a Native American dollar, that was uh, Native American contributions to the space program. Is put this uh, uh, as you can see that Mary uh, Gilba, uh, Golda Ross is who that is. She's a mathematician, pretty uh, uh, pretty amazing uh, uh, woman, as a matter of fact. Uh, if we go in close right there, you can see. Right in there, there's a very elegant, simple equation, which is what she came up with. And that equation is the equation, you can see that uh, uh, right there is, there it is right there, see that little equation? That's the uh, energy, in essence, required to leave the atmosphere of Earth and to enter the atmosphere of another planet, is what that oh, very elegant little now. equation is right oh, there. that's cool. Yeah, that's right. What is that? Uh, v infinity is V over 2PF. Uh, I don't... I uh, my, she would know what it means, I but I readers. certainly don't. Wait, let me look on my card. <laughs> yeah, yeah, let me look on your card. <laughs> okay. Oh, well, clearly, clearly you can do that if you read Chinese, right? <laughs> so, hey, now. <laughs> hey now, no, no, no. <laughs> yeah, and, but the fact is, is, is that was she was instrumental in uh, in uh, Apollo 11 and in the U.S. or not the Apollo 11, but in the U.S. space program uh, after the fact. And so that's why she's honored here. With we have the rocket ship, and that's all the Apollo 11. So you get that in the original government packaging with the original government box. The key to this, though, is of course the West Point minted Lincoln cent that you have over here. The first time they've ever done an additional coin like that in a proof set that they put out separately. I mean, it's just, you know, in, in 2009, they did the four special Lincoln cents for the 100th anniversary of the Lincoln cent. This year, technically, the, and, the 110th anniversary of the Lincoln cent, and they decided to do something cool, and they, like I said, they put a West Point mint mark on it, but then they did this. So they took a coin and almost guaranteed that any high grade, PR69, PR70, becoming virtually impossible to get because of the way that they packaged the coin. I just wanted to show that to you right there so that you could see. Because this coin's now been a, a, our sample here for a couple of weeks. That's right. probably a PR63 or something uh, uh, right now. So to get yours, once it goes in here, then it's locked in in that PR69, and you finally know that you've got that great coin, and you don't have to worry about uh, uh, you know degrading the grade of the coin anymore. It's going to come in the Red Oak presentation box. So this is the way it comes to you, Red Oak presentation box with the full uh, proof set and the 2019, as you can see, the 2000. 19 U.S. proof set. Let me turn that just like that. Look at that. So that so penny pretty. is absolutely positively <laughs> stunning. Now, I think we are coming very close to the end of event pricing on this as well. Yes, and with that event pricing, we're taking that $20 off, so it's $99.95. You also have three flexible payments, and because of Customer Appreciation Month, we have extra flex with your HSN credit card for Coin Collector. So that rarely happens. I don't think I've ever seen that, and I've worked with Mike quite a bit, but we have it today, and definitely take advantage, so that's $24.99 wow. with that extra flexible payment, and that is a smart way to shop. If you don't have the HSN credit card, you can apply in a upon approval, that'll take that set down because we're doing $20 off upon approval. Guess what? That takes it down to $79.95. And on mm. three flexible payments of $33.32, I know we are wrapping up on this one. 665-485 is your item number. But we also want to kind of say stay tuned because we have a lot of new and exciting things to share with you like this brand new oh. uh, Explore and Discover set. Mike, what is so exciting about this? Because this is we really have this unique. A new set 
set just put out by the United States government. They only made 50,000, so we've got fantastic limited editions right there. Uh, I love that. And then a very, very number one first by the U.S. government. They've never released a blank planchet coin before, and they've done it with that. Plus, when we get to that, I'll show you, it's a really great collection. We're going to give you all the rest of the collection. We just certified the, the cents out of there, because those are the important coins out of there, because those were the special coins. If you look, there's a special finish on the Lincoln cent, so that makes it special as well, particularly uh, uh, out of, uh, by provenance with only 50,000, that's the rarest Lincoln cent ever made, not even close in terms of just the Lincoln cent, because it's an SP69 out of this Explore and Discover set, so you have your rarest Lincoln cent, then you're going to have the blank planchet in there as well, which the United States government has ever, ever done before. I'm doing the entire thing with both of those certified in the presentation box for only $99.95, plus I give you the other coins as well. So you put all that together. I think it's just truly spectacular. Only 1,304 in the in the first day limited edition. I believe I will sell every, we have a primetime show tonight from right. 8 to 10 p.m. Eastern. I believe we will sell every one of the 1,304 of those uh, today. Okay, and so what's nice is because you're the early bird gets the worm, you can get it now. You do not have to wait. So continue to call in on that, but stay tuned. We have our American Legion coin, which is brand new, coming up. With so many places to shop, we wanted to say that your loyalty doesn't go unnoticed. So to celebrate Customer Appreciation Month, we're making the entire month of April all about you. We're giving away $1,000 a day to your favorite charities. So many extras for HSN credit card holders. And one lucky winner will win $25,000. It could be you. From all of us, we'd like to say... and you're looking to impress your friends, let me show you how to make this beautiful seafood boil using my DuraPan. Let's do seafood for the dinner party. I'm about to set off. Hey guys, let's eat. That's oh. The appraised values you see at HSN are set by independent, professionally certified appraisers. They determine, as closely as possible, the approximate retail cost of replacing or recreating the item, not the possible sell or purchase price. Because subjective estimates and judgments are involved, appraisals may vary by as much as 25%. Call your customer service rep for more information. Opinion helps us create the content we know you'll love. Well, it is Customer Appreciation Month, and we are celebrating you. And we are featuring coins over the next two hours. I'll be with you, and Mike will be with you until 3 a.m. this morning. So we have lots in store for you. I promise you a brand new coin. We have many brand new items we're featuring this evening, but we're going to talk about the American Legion coin. First I've seen it is why I just it, pulled it off. And right, and this is I brand to... new today. This yep. is a nice way to remember our military and our vets, as we always should. But this is the 100th anniversary. Anniversary right. of the American Legion. Of the founding of the American Legion. And it was founded in, actually in Paris, France, oh, by the, uh, at the end of World War I by the members of the American Expeditionary Force of World War I, and they formed the American oh, Legion. Pretty cool. Now, uh, isn't it just absolutely gorgeous yeah. with all of kind of mm -hmm. the, this is the accoutrement of the, of the United States Army. So you're going to have it the oak like leaves. It's like a badge of like yeah. honor. Well, that's really what it is. Yeah, that's the badge right there. Oak leaves, of, if you've ever heard of it, you know, with oak leaf clusters. So when they put oak leaves on something.
something that adds to the prestige of the honor. Here is the American Legion. Here's the flags that you're going to have right there. The Notice the uh, fleur de lis up there at the top because it was it was from uh, it was uh, founded in France, France, in Paris, France. So they've included that as well. 100 years of service that you're going to have right there. There's the U.S. flag and that now. Oh, that's nice. So this is a commemorative dollar put out by the United States government. So this is official United States currency. It's done in, in silver as well. So that's, that's important. That's a big deal uh, uh, with that. First day of issue. Here's what I want to point out. The United States government has been making these, the, these silver dollars, these commemorative silver dollars since 1982, basically. We've been doing first day of issues on those as long as I've been here. So 20 years I've been doing them, plus we've done the back years. I have never done in release because of the complexity of this design this is by far by limited edition the rarest commemorative dollar i have ever done here at hsn so in other words they do usually two commemorative dollars per year mm -hmm. i've been here so i've done dozens and dozens and dozens and dozens of these i mean when we did like the baseball coin we did 3700 Okay, when we did the Apollo coin, what'd we do? Mm -hmm. 1197 or something like that. I like that coin. I got 157 <laughs> exclusive first day of issue American Legions. Now, I'm not charging any extra for them. I mean, my regular issue price, $169.95. You still get the Red Oak presentation box. The key right here, 157 that you're going to have in our limited first day of issue, 100th anniversary of the American Legion. You see, we did the special label with the American flags in there. But so, so not only do you have this fantastic coin, not only do you have this commemorative coin, and, and when we originally purchased this coin, a, a portion of the proceeds, of course, goes to the American Legion. That's the way they do commemorative dollars. There's always kind of a, a, a charitable component to that as well. But I've only got 157 in first day of issue, absolutely, positively perfect. So of all of these, I, I did the Buffalo dollars in 2001. Uh, you know, those were 2,200 sold. You know, and I've sold all these out in the literally in the thousands and thousands and thousands. But because of this, they were extremely difficult to grade because of all this ornate work that you're going to have on the coin itself. Look at that. Isn't that stunning with the oak leaves that you're going to have it's in right there? magnificent. It really is it's beautiful. It's truly a magnificent coin. And then you look on the reverse of that, done in silver, as you can see with the representative American flag right there, the flag of the American Legion there. You're going to have the flair de lis right there, 100 years of service from the United States. You put all of those things together, extremely difficult to grade. And so because of that it's not just that it's a great commemorative coin and of course you know it's, it's an important commemorative coin but the limited edition here is not something that I usually speak to in, in huge regard in terms of the value of the coin but it's extraordinarily important in this coin that there's only 157 of these to go around uh, and uh, okay, we're already down to 150. So what's happening is these are starting to sell. And once we do that, <clears throat> once again, so I have done basically two commemorative dollars per year here certified. In all of the years that I have been here, mm -hmm. nothing approaches this in rarity. I think prior to this, it's maybe three, four, five hundred is the lowest uh, uh, addition that we've ever done on a commemorative dollar coin, silver commemorative dollar. And, and understand, it's not like I mean, this is an important, this is an important um, uh, uh, commemorative design as well with the American Legion. Uh, 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 with that, sometimes it kind of is, you know, kind of some of the, uh, the commemorative dollars are kind of odd. They do two per per year, but the American Legion's a big deal. I mean, you go into, into basically any town in the United States, and there's an American there's Legion, Legion Hall. I mean, yes. you know. I mean, we've all had dinner at the American Legion Hall. I mean, you know, at some point or another, uh, uh, we have. And, of course, you know, honoring the service of, uh, 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 of Americans now for, uh, for 100 years with the American Legion. And so when we have that, unfortunately, I mean, you know, 150, 157 is all that we have available exclusively here in our first day of issue annex that you're going to have. No additional cost for this. I mean, our regular issue price on a commemorative dollar is like $169.95, but just an extraordinarily limited edition on this 
already starting to go down. With a very brief mention, I'm sure in our prime time, I think this will be a one day only sellout. One of oh, our absolutely. one and dones that we have here in the and coin business that becomes so difficult for us. Yeah. Absolutely, and because of just the popularity of this coin, we're gonna stick here just a few more moments to process all the mm -hmm. orders. Oh, you my can goodness. see there are 137 now remaining and that is it. So even if there are like 10 left in the prime time, 50 left, because a lot of times you guys watch and you'll record it and you watch and you're like, hmm, and you kind of do a little research. <laughs> I don't want you to wait until this evening because I have a feeling that this is going to go. So this mm -hmm. is such a wonderful way. If I had 560 or 800 or, right. or what, I, what normal addition in this, yeah, you would have you would have until you know tomorrow morning or tomorrow afternoon or whatever to be able to make your decision. But right now with everybody on the phone and as quickly as they're selling, I would jump on this very, very, very quickly. Right. On Mike, this. has the American Legion ever had a commemorative coin? No, 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 coin? no, no, no. Each thing gets one, gets it one, oh, one time. One, one and time. Done. Yeah, one and done oh, is what see, it I does. I didn't know that. So okay. they've done like, they've done the Marine Corps and they've done the the, the, um, the Air Force and they've done the Army and they've done lots of those. They've done U.S. generals. They've done, uh, you know. So they don't uh, repeat. They do not repeat. And so this is the American Legion commemorative dollar, the only one that will ever be done. And of course, the, the coin is a limited edition from the United States government, but then our limited edition in terms of perfect proof, 100th anniversary, first day of issue, absolutely, positively stunning opportunity at a third, a fourth, a fifth less than what we uh, uh, normally are able to do on this. Only 157, with everybody on the line, we're well under 100 of these that will ever be available. Once it's sold out, that's it, done, gone, and, and over. And it's done in 70. So it yeah. has Oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. It, our first day of issue in proof 70. So highest possible grade there. Um, also, oh. very limited. We feature the American Innovation on auto ship, mm -hmm. um, $89.95. Now the highlight here is not only the coin, but we have 50 left. Mm -hmm. And that is it for this auto ship. For you mm -hmm. to be able to secure this, Mike, give us a little synopsis here. Yeah, it's just, we just have so few of these because of right. the, uh, 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 just because they're so phenomenally, ridiculously difficult to grade. And if you'll notice uh, also that this is a, a, a numbered limited edition that you're going to have on this, the American Innovation Dollar. This is the Annex coin actually that we have only 500 of day one innovation dollar that we have as that special. Uh, that doesn't, the picture doesn't it match doesn't. the graphic there. So, oh, yeah. okay. So, so that, well, that's why I was a little confused. All right. Yeah. So you are going to get the American Innovation Dollar. That's correct. Right. And it's proof yes. seventy. Yes. And it's going to be and it's going to be our premier edition PCGS. Okay. Yeah. So just the picture was not matching yeah. the graphic, but it'll That's still correct. be the American Innovation Coin on auto correct, ship with correct. fifty left. Exactly. All right. All right. Perfect. Let's move right along, and to really the most mm -hmm. collected silver bullion coin today ever. And we're talking about the Silver Eagle. Now this is going back a little bit. This is taking us back to 1995. I have to, we gotta spend a second here. Okay. The United States government has been making the American Silver Eagle since 1986. It has been the most popularly collected silver coin in the world, and I believe today it's the most popularly collected coin in the world, because everybody right. <coughs> collects American Silver Eagles at some level. We sell mint state 70s here on a fairly regular basis. Right, but do we take $100 off? We don't, <laughs> and I have been here for almost 20 years. Right. This is the very first time I have ever offered a 1995 American Silver Eagle in Mint State 70. Really? I've never done that before. Why is that? Because they just don't exist. Okay. You have to understand. And then we took $100 off and they don't exist? Why? They, they don't exist. I, that, I, don't, I can't explain the event pricing. I, I, <laughs> I put it in at $8.99. Someone right. else has made it $7.99. <laughs> I don't know exactly why. Okay. Uh, you have to understand. So I've sold 1986 to 1989. We sell those little blocks of coins. We sell 2001 to 2016. We sell those blocks of coins. But what I've never done before for these mid 90s coins, okay? The mid 90s coins in mint state 70, not only are they exceptionally rare by mintage, but by, uh, 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 but by grade in mint state 70. So if you go to the next year, the, the three key coins to the American Silver Eagle series, 95, 96, and 97 in mint state 70. It's the reason that the mint state 70 set is like $45,000. The 1996, the coin right after this, $8,000 in 
in Min State 70. That's the 96? That's the 96. Wow. That's the rarest of all the regular issue uh, Silver Eagles. But the 95's not far off. Okay. And in Min State 70, I'm telling you, here's what I can tell you. You go out there, I don't care where you look. You can go look at, at, at uh, Annex, you can look at PCGS. You, you look at PCGS or NGC, you're not gonna touch this coin for less than three to $5,000, period. Just not gonna touch this coin for less than three to $5,000, and it could perhaps even be more than that. So at $799.95, at it is a spectacular coin. I've got a couple of dozen of these to go around. That's it. That's why I'm spending some time here. I don't know, and the fact is, is once I sell these few coins that I have, they simply are not going to be available again. I must impress upon you, if you're one of our regular collectors here, and you've been trying to put together an American Silver Eagle Min State 70 set, and you bought, let's say, and we've sold a couple of hundred, which is a huge number. Like in modern issue Min State 70s, we sell 10,000, 12,000, 15,000, because we, you know, the government takes care of them, we buy them in the boxes, everybody knows what you gotta do now. Yeah, nobody, even I wasn't selling certified coins, uh, American Silver Eagles in 1995. I was the very first person to sell certified modern issue American coins. Everybody laughed at me. <laughs> and that was in 1999. Oh, look, at, look at you now, Mike. Yeah, well, and they did say, they said, oh, that's absurd. Nobody's gonna get us buy a Silver Eagle that's certified. I mean, literally, they had uh, the president of one of the major grading companies come out and say, well, we'll never certify modern issue coins. Of course, it's the backbone of the hobby. Right. But that was 1999. Right, because condition matters, okay. like Condition you matters. Well, in you look at 1995, that's a half a decade before that. The government didn't take any care in these coins whatsoever. Getting these coins in Mint State 70 is a virtual impossibility. They just simply don't exist. Did they and not make enough? No, they made them, but they it? just didn't take care of them. And nobody took care, because nobody started really grading the coins until 10 years later. Mm. And so because of that, they opened up the boxes and people just didn't take care of them like today. And not only that, but the coins themselves, like this year they're going to make 40 million American Silver Eagles, something like that. And I think what's the mintage on this one, about 4.2 million, something like that. Uh, uh, so it's 10 times rarer than the regular American Silver Eagle that we're doing today. But in Mint State 70, in this absolutely positively perfect grade, good luck finding that anywhere. And if you do, it's absolutely positively not possible for you to find that in Annex or PCGS or NGC for At less than a thousand, well, less than a thousand dollars. And, I, don't, and I suspect it's more like three or 4,000 wow. if you go out there and try to find it. So at $899, this was a special, special coin. At $799, it is literally a unique one-time collecting opportunity. So if you're looking to put this coin, if you're looking to build that Min State 70 perfect set, you have, this is one of the absolute key coins to buy, and we've put it at a price that is absolutely unheard of and simply not available in the marketplace any place well, else. Well, it's kind of crazy good. Like, it's that opportunistic buy where all the stars are aligning, and you come on in, and you save that $100, get it at home. Some of the highlights when you shop here at HSN for Coin Collector is Mike Cherry picks the best of the best. We are bringing you the highest possible grade, which is that 70. Now, the thing is, you have the 30-day money-back guarantee. You have flex pay, which is one of the smartest things to take advantage of. Now, I know you're going, Robin, typically in the world of Coin Collector, if you shop with us all the time, you know this. At a coin that's $800, typically doesn't get flex pay. It just doesn't. <laughs> I can't explain it. But tonight, and for Customer Appreciation Month, because we appreciate you, we are doing extra flexible, uh, flexible payments on our HSN credit card. So now is the time. If you have the HSN credit card, if you don't, apply for it. Because guess what? You get two flexible payments of $399.98. So if you are like Mike said, and you're someone who's been trying to piece together your Silver Eagle collection, and the 95 has been that one coin that's elusive, that yes. you just can't get, or that is not in your price range. Tonight is the night. Now, I also have a, a limited number of right? 97s. Okay. I think they're the same price, if I'm not mistaken. If we, so, we, it you, is, you need Mike, to buy so both. What's it that? Is, it, is. it is. Yeah, and you it's need to buy both off. coins. They're the only two that I have. And, and the same thing with the 97. I've never offered a 1997. Now, you have to understand, 2,000, which they made far more coins of, 
you can easily spend $799, you can spend $1,000, $1,500, you know, $2,000 for a, a year 2000 mm -hmm. And I was grading coins by then. I sold thousands of 2000 Min State 70s. This is the first time I've ever sold the 95s. You have to understand, now once again, there are 1995 American Silver Eagles out there. But in mint state 70, that's the key. Now remember, in coin collecting as in e collecting, the single most important determining factor of value is what? Condition. That's right, the higher the grade, the more it's worth. This coin and 70 is the highest grade that we sell. So in other words, in coins, for whatever reason, we, we didn't do a 100 point scale. Right. We did a 70 point scale with 70 being, there's no mint state 71 or 70.1, so this is perfect. So literally, there are, in existence, mint state 70 probably no more than a couple of hundred of these coins. Whereas in a modern issue, mint state 70, you're looking at 200, 300, 400,000 mint state 70s. Now, it's still not many out of 40 million coins, but it is, this is literally exponentially rarer. These are the whole that are in collections out there for people trying to put together that registry mint state 70 absolutely positively perfect set. This is the first time that this coin has been offered for less than two or three or four or five thousand dollars at seven hundred ninety nine dollars like I said. It is not only one of the key coins to buy but I'm able to offer it and it should be I could put any price on it. I could put seventeen hundred dollars on it. I could put twenty seven hundred dollars on it and because they're not available and the ones that you see are significantly significantly more money What's happened is, is because we sell so many Min State 69 sets. If you go to hsn.com, we do our, our, our auto ship sets of the Min State 69s. We literally sell thousands and thousands of those. They're very popular. Even the Min State 69s are significantly difficult to get. Because of that, we have a very few, we've got a handful of the Min State 79s in both the 1995 and the 1997. It is a unique opportunity in all the years that I've been here. This is the very first time I've ever been able to sell the 1995s or the 1997s in 20 in years. In 20 years. In 20 in years. In 70 uh, uh, wow. here at HSN. Yeah, exactly. Mike, that's incredible. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's so funny. I'm standing here thinking like, how long did it take you to put this together and get this? Well, and then I'm thinking like 20 years. We've never had it 20 before. years, right. Yeah, we graded literally... To do that, how many Silver Eagles have I graded over the years? I don't know, a couple of million. Right. And wow. so, you know, we've got, uh, uh, you know, dozens of these coins is ultimately what it comes down to, which is one of the reasons I can do the price. Uh, right. And why we'll sell every single solitary one of them. Understand, there's not a lot of these coins to go right. around. And, and once those are gone, those are really gone, right. is, is really uh, ultimately what the issue is. So here's the 95. This is your chance. And if you've been waiting, this is quite likely could be the only chance that you have not only to own this coin, but particularly to own this coin at $799.95. Right. And we're taking $100 off. Yeah, I, I don't wish get that. I knew. Yeah, I don't I, understand why. What's the reasoning Well, not when that? you start thinking when Mike's talking about the other grading companies with this coin and the price that they're fetching. Yeah. So to be able to get it here today at $100 off in 20 years, Mike has never been able to present a Mint State 70 Silver Eagle for $19.95. So that's really saying something. If this is that elusive coin, you've been trying to add it to your collection, now is the time. Now, here is the 1997. So if you are trying to add this as well, it is here. It is the highest possible grade, Mint State 70. Now they here's the, the thing. They did the event price on this they one did. too. did. Both the 95 and the 97 Silver Eagles are $100 off. They are both on extra flex with your HSN credit card. I highly recommend that. Typically at this price point, we don't see flex pays. Now the only way you can get that flex pay is gonna be with your HSN credit card. If you don't have the HSN credit card, you can apply, you'll take tw an extra $20 off, and you're gonna get those two flexible payments. Sorry, I'm just ad no, admiring okay. the coin. Are you so impressed? Yeah, I am. Yeah. I mean, I know I knew we had these. to grade 70. Oh, almost impossible. Almost impossible. What, what happens is, is when the United States government made these early coins like this, when they when they wash the planches, they have to wash the planches, they didn't do a very good job. So they oftentimes have, there's, they're very spotty. You've mm -hmm. got all kinds of problems with the coins. They didn't take great care with the coins themselves. You do all those things. So to get any of these early coins in Min State 70 is virtually impossible. Mm -hmm. 
the 95 and the 97 are specifically insanely difficult to get in Mint State 70. They are the keys that the vast majority of Mint State 70 collections are just not going to have these coins. I wish I had some 96s, but even, even for me in Annex, those are going to be $5,000, $7,000 for the 96s. 96. They were particularly bad, although the 95s and 97s aren't much better, mm -hmm. uh, uh, the fact of the matter is. The 96s are, are key coin, is the absolute key coin to the set, followed by the 95 and the 97. Those three years are, the, are literally the centerpiece of the American Silver Eagle collection in condition, from a conditional aspect. Uh, not only that, by grade, those are three of the rarest American Silver Eagles as well. But in Min State 70, that is the core of any modern issue registry set. And, and they collect things that are called registry sets. A registry set is the highest graded set in existence. So in Silver Eagles, that would be Min State 70. That would be a registry set. That would be the highest grade of each coin. But most of, uh, of these sets that people are doing are missing the 95, the 96, and the 97 in Min State 70 because not only do they not exist, but they're, they're so, so unaffordable. Whereas this has got great value and a great affordability, uh, a great affordability in this coin as well. So if you're putting that set together, let's say you bought the 86 to 89 from us, okay? And I think that was $1,500 for those four coins. Right. Very, very difficult to get. These coins, absolutely a must add to that, uh, right. to that so, set, the collection. 668702, that's for the 97. So 1997, highest possible grade here on the Silver Eagle, $799.95 at $100 off. Now, many of you are still kind of calling in and picking up your American Legion. This is celebrating the 100th anniversary of the Silver Dollar and the American Legion. Uh, American Legion. It's $169.95. Only of those left, so it will be a one and done. Mike. Yeah, it will you, be a one and done. Can we show it here? I promise I'll hold it still. <laughs> the crew just laughed at me. They're yeah. like, yeah, right. Yeah. No, I will. Look, yeah. look Mike, Pretty talk good. to us about well, What we have beautiful. right there, so we have the, the commemorative dollar just released by the United States government commemorating the 100th anniversary of the American Legion. So you've got the American Legion badge, you've got the oak leaf clusters, if you will, yes. 